go, what's up guys, it's Lucid back again with another video, and before I get to the video, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe if you're new. Like, come on now, we're on the road to a thousand subs, be here before we hit a thousand, like, stop playing, subbing is for free, like, come on bro. Alright, but as you guys can see, we're back on Black Ops Cold War. And in this gameplay, I'm using the new Serpent Idol uh, Bullfrog class setup. It's that variant that comes in the Battle Pass, that green and white and gold one. So it's kind of like uh, the KSP one that came out like Season 3, but it's for the Bullfrog. But yeah, in this gameplay, I drop a Nuclear with the Bullfrog. I use the class setup that was given for the Serpent, and then I make my own class setup. I will be showing both of them. I went off both gameplays, the, their class setup and my class setup. You guys just got to see what happened. It was crazy, bro. But this is a Serpent Idol. This is what comes on it. it comes Comes with the Spet Snaz Compensator. Comes with the Extended Barrel. Comes with the Spet Snaz Speed Grip. It comes with the 80 round mag or the 85 round mag. And it comes with the Tactical Stock. This class up is not too bad. I literally was going off. I think I went like 65 and 5 running this. It was crazy, bro. I was shredding with this thing. The class setup I run, my own class setup, this is what I run. I run the GRU Suppressor. I run the Task Force Barrel. I run the 85 Speed Mag. I run the Elastic Wrap. And I run the Skeletal Stock. This is my class setup. And honestly, is the best class setup for the bullfrog but yeah if you guys are gonna run eight attachments for the underbarrel you can run the spet snaz grip for the body you can run a laser or the tiger team spotlight and uh for the optic which i really wouldn't recommend an optic but if you want to run an optic for some reason you don't like the iron sight then run the micro reflex honestly it's just the best one for submachine guns in general because it's a small optic but yeah anyways hope you guys enjoy the video subscribe if you're new don't forget to slap on the post notification so you miss the latest and greatest videos and i'll see you later guys peace all right just joined this game just started i'm running uh the bullfrog uh it's the serpent bullfrog it's the one you'd get in the battle pass right now i'm just running the attachments that come with it and then i'm gonna run my own attachments to show my class setup for the bullfrog let me fall back This is their spawn, most definitely. He survived being one shot? Yo. Yo, this class up's not too bad, to be honest. I mean, there's plenty of better attachments to run. I almost turned on home skillet. I probably should just go for a nuke with these attachments. Let me place a field mic up here since I'm already here. And it is hard points so the spawns can flip at any time. And that's why I always place my field mic behind me so I know when someone randomly spawn flips. Cause kill confirm a hard point have those random spawn flips all the time, bruh. I can't see squat, bruh. They got smoke throwers. This gotta be some sort of joke. I just lagged forward. What the hell? Harp. A counter UAV? Come on. He gonna air patrol my stuff. Oh no, that's their- that was our air patrol. Never mind. I knew you're coming. Yeah, both sides of the map. I hate the hand cannon on this game mode though, bro. Since characters move so fast, it's so hard to aim at them. That comes down to you and the opponents. Mm -mm. I knew it was coming. How did that miss? No, I'm gone. Another spawn flip? Yo, come on. Bro, they are everywhere. No way. 
He blew up and killed. This is why I hate this game mode. I literally was about to get a nuke. So then I finally kill him and he blows up. What in me? <laughs> Bro, they everywhere. Dude's moving around like flies. I went 65 and 5. That's pretty good. All right. And that's why I like Molotovs. They let me know when someone's gonna push from the side I'm not looking at because no one ever looks at the other sides I'm not looking at. Where are these kids, yo? Bro, they got six dudes and I ain't seen one of them. An entire team of people just camping with snipers. No one on their team is moving, bruh. I'll just sit in your spawn, bruh, to be honest. Bruh, this honestly gotta be the slowest domination game I've ever played. Like, you know when it's gotten bad when I'm in they spawn destroying stuff. Bruh, there's so many pink dots, I don't know which way to look. He shot me in the back with a sniper. Come on, dude. What? That RV kid's movement was very cheesy. Something I have never seen ever. I'll sit and they spawn a spawn trap them. I need to get up out of here. They know I've been there for too long. The problem is they got too many snipers on their team. Bro, I can't stand snipers. Snipers make me so scared and make me play so weird, bro. That's because snipers can't be properly countered. You can just have a dumb luck target assist lock on and you're, whoever is there is just dead. Bruh, I am too scared to push. But I need to for my new. Hell no. Nope. I saw my partner just get obliterated when he tried to hit that corner. I need to get my grenade launcher to push. Hell no. Bruh, my, they just swapped. I got the nuke, let's go. Woo! I got it last second, yo. Oh my god. I got a hit marker on the kid upstairs with the grenade launcher. Thought it was gonna end one kill off a nuke due to that. I hate playing up against anything that can one-shot, like shotguns, snipers, and crossbows and crap. 
because it can easily kill you off a nuke without them even trying. All it is, it just comes down to target assist working or not, which everyone knows is very inconsistent in Cold War. But yeah, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you're new. Don't forget to slap on the post notification so you miss the latest and greatest videos. And I'll see you later, guys. Peace.